D is committed, um, and he's as excited as we are to have him back. D's as excited or more excited to come back to his university and his city. Um, D went to Bowles. D went to JU. He's coming home. And, you know, D's going to be a mentor for a lot of people. He's going to be a mentor for me. He's going to be a mentor for our staff. He's going to be a mentor for our coaches. He's going to be a mentor for our student athletes. Um, he's going to really serve in a role where, you know, D's worked and played at levels that never, none of us have ever seen. Right. And so he's going to be able to really communicate and, and create an environment where he's going to be able to pick up where our blind spots are. Right? You need to... You need to create a staff and a culture where uh, you understand that you have shortcomings. Well, D can really, because of his experience, really fill a lot of those blind spots by those ex by his experiences, by who he's worked with, by you know the level that he's played at, and he immediately has credibility with our coaches and our student athletes. Um, and so he's going to run a lot of our player development stuff for for not just basketball, for all of our programs. He's going to sort of serve in a role as a coach's coach, you know, okay. be able to mentor our coaches um, with, with, with team dynamic, with player dynamic, with administrative dynamic. But also from a university perspective, there's no better ambassador, right? He's going to be able to really help in spaces like admissions, right? Like recruitment, like retention, like um, fundraising. Um, and just general community engagement. And so to have D, have a talent like D back on campus, I couldn't be more thrilled. 